welcome to Drawing with Rembrandt. Do you remember me? I am your host, Rembrandt, of course. Yes, I am the Dutch master from the 1600s, known for my use of light, for my Bible pictures, and my amazing portraits with expression. We are going to work on mirror images again today. Let's try a few more complex mirror image projects. Join me. Now, we will do a more complex mirror image picture. First, we will draw the first half. So, in about the middle of the line that you've already drawn down the center of your page, we are going to a little dot and put one underneath not too far away and we are going to come out in a circular line a curved line I should say and we are going to fill that in now from that curved line about the center of the top of it we are going to bring out another large curved line Let's bring it down to a dot uh, a little bit below that, much further than the other one. Uh, we are going to bring it around like a big cheek. And off to the left a little bit. I have a dot. I bring that in a curved line to the center. And I go beyond that with another curved line. So we have kind of a parallel curved line set coming into the center, our line of symmetry. Those are like the lips. And over here, coming out of this cheek, we have a vertical line. On this cheek, we are going to put a few dots, just small ones. All right, now, close to our nose shape, we are going to start a curved line coming out of this cheek. And we are going to draw a big curved line going up and around back to the cheek. Inside of this curved line, we will form another smaller curved line. And we will color that in. Can you see what this is now? It is an eye. Very good. Now, out of the almost the side of the cheek, we are going to draw another large curved line to form the head. And we are going to put a dot up here to where we are aiming for. Actually, we might start up there and aim for there. Either way, I will start on the cheek so I know where I'm coming from. And bring the head up in a curved line to the dot. And over here, I'm going to put a couple of dots coming out of the head so I know where to start the ear. So I'm going to bring a curved line from the one closest to the line of symmetry. I bring it out and back around and up. And then I bring a straight line here. I might have to connect them a little. We want a dot shape above the eye for an eyebrow. I fill it in. And there we have one half of a face of a dog. Now let's do the mirror image of the dog face. Let's start with the nose again. So we have a dot here, on our line of symmetry, we will bring the curve out to the right, which is opposite of the way we did it when we drew the first half. We bring it around and touch it on the dot at the bottom of the nose and we color it in. Next, we will do the cheek. So we start about halfway through this curve here on the right side 
and we are going to bring another curved line to a big cheek that comes around and meets at this dot at the bottom of this cheek. It might be a little small on this side, but we will go on. I make mistakes, so you will feel better. And I'm going to form the lips, so I will start at the dot on the line of symmetry, bring a curve around and up to touch the cheek, and we will do the one below it as well. Bring it up, very good. We'll bring a vertical line out of the bottom of this cheek. We need to match these dots. This is a little more tricky on the eyes sometimes, but this is okay. You can make mistakes. You can always erase. Very good. Now I will do the eye. I'm going to start on the inside with the eye uh, coming out of the top of this cheek close to the line of symmetry in a big curved line and bring it back down towards the outside of the cheek. Then I draw another curved line right on the inside of this one and I color it in. Now we will finish the face. I'm going to start at the top, at the dot of the center on the line of symmetry and I'm going to bring it a nice big curved line out to the right and back down to touch this side of the cheek. And we will make some another ear. We'll start about here. Maybe come back to here. And we have a big curved line going off to the right, coming down, back around and up, and then we bring a line up here to meet it. One more thing. We have our dot shape above the eyebrow, almost like a kidney bean shape. Well, it is the eyebrow, I should say, above the eye. And there we have it. We have our dog made from a mirror image. So we will erase our line in the center. We will fix a few of these lines. We have made a mirror image dog. Good job. See? You can draw mirror images. You can draw when you join us on Drawing with Rembrandt. Please like this video, subscribe to our channel, and join me again on Drawing with Rembrandt.